And when we talk about the nervous system, we're really talking about several levels of organization, starting with two main parts, the central and peripheral nervous systems. The central nervous system is your brain and spinal cord, the main control center. Your peripheral nervous system is composed of all the nerves that branch off from the brain and spine that allow your central nervous system to communicate with the rest of your body. The sensory, or afferent division, is what picks up sensory stimuli, like, hey, there's an arachnid on you, and slings that information to the brain. Your motor, or efferent division, is the part that sends direction from your brain to the muscles and glands. The motor division also includes the somatic, or voluntary, nervous system that rules your skeletal muscle movement, and the autonomic, or involuntary, nervous system that keeps your heart beating and your lungs breathing and your stomach churning. And finally, that autonomic system, too, has its own complementary forces. Its sympathetic division mobilizes the body into action and gets it all fired up like, ah, spider! While the parasympathetic division relaxes the body and talks it down, like, it wasn't a black widow or anything, you're fine, breathe. So that's the organization of your nervous system in a nutshell.